that's what happened when I spent the day zoning in the sofa because I wasn't feeling well. Girl, just stop trying to testify your mess. Sometimes, just because I feel lazy as well. I didn't prepare the, the clothes I have to wear to go to work and I took all this off my wardrobe. Anyway, uh, I will tidy this up when I get back home tonight. Good morning, everyone. It's Tuesday. Um, I'm a bit sick. We are getting back to the office. I was four days off, actually one day off. Uh, but then we had a holiday from Spain and the weekend. So here I am, I'm a bit tired because I haven't been feeling well those last two days. Here's the outfit. I mean, not the shoes, obviously, <laughs> but I usually wear black to go to the office. So let's go. I have become aware of the direct link between my physical health, well-being, and productivity, and concentration, and determination, <laughs> a lot of ends. Well, essentially, my happiness and how I am able to be consistent with my plans overall. I usually work out in the morning, but I try to be flexible according to my body need. On top of giving me more energy and improving my physical condition, it has increased my level of discipline. And I can't wait for how far it's going to get me with my future plans. I truly believe that discipline is the key and having a hobby or something that you do for yourself will actively teach you how discipline is essential. When you are on your journey of finding yourself, there might be a couple of bumps along the way. And this week, I had one of those days. You know, those days when everything seems to go wrong. But you know what? Hold on, because it's all for the good and things will eventually get better. Good morning guys, how are you doing? So this morning we are having a um, uh, little self-care treatment, skin care treatment, you know I'm into skin care, and I'm trying for the first time the micro needling. To be honest, I haven't done much skin care treatment in institutes in my whole life maybe two or three times only and this is something i want to try to do once a month at least so i'm starting with the micro needling because i want to reduce the um, the appearance of my here and here and also i want to fade my uh, acne uh, scares so uh, I'm, I don't think that you are going to see a huge difference after the first uh, session. I'm still going to show you a picture. But you might start seeing something after the third or the fourth session. Let's see. I'm excited and I'm a bit nervous because I have a very sensitive skin. And I just hope this treatment is not um, too aggressive for for the skin in general.
I'll let you know how it feels. I, I'll bring you along with me anyway. Microneedling is a part of the collagen induction therapy. It is a cosmetic procedure that involves repeatedly puncturing the skin with tiny needles. You can choose the depth of your needles according to your skin sensitivity and also your pain tolerance. For me, self-love involves treating yourself with kindness, compassion, and understanding, just as you will do for your loved one. We all have our own way to express love to oneself. So far, my priorities this year are accepting myself as I am, prioritizing my health, setting healthy boundaries, and also forgiving myself when needed. We have finished with the treatment and now she's going to put a mask. You can tell that my skin is a bit red. Healing can be a tough physical and mental process. Creating myself a routine <laughs> has provided me an emotional stability and a way to navigate these big waves. I will shoot bluebirds in the spring to give your heart a song to sing and then a kiss for more than this I wish you love and in July a lemonade to okay just got back home from that first microneedling session it's so funny because the girl right after the treatment she puts me some cream and blah blah and then she was like what do you think glowing no like she was talking about my skin and i was like uh no i don't know was it was it bad for me to just say the truth because i don't know it wasn't glowing and even though its might was glowing a bit it was probably the cream not the treatment does it make sense i love when people do their skincare and they're like "Ooh, look at my skin now it's glowing obviously girl it's glowing you just put some cream and oil on your face so you're gonna glow I'm actually very proud of myself for catching up with you every Sunday for the past 20 weeks. Whoa! Thank you for all the support. You guys are actually really starting to feel like my friends. I have started the channel with uh, the intention of documenting my life for my future self and I have fell in love with the creative process from filming, to writing, to editing a video. It is not easy as I still try to figure out the best routine to be productive without burning out myself, 
but I'm slowly making my way to it. Avec tout mon amour, un besito, Shell.